Shalom Aleichem. Peace be upon you. Friends, this Sunday is the Mission Sunday for the Catholic Church all over the world. It reminds us about ourselves and tells us who we are and what we should be doing. One of the most interesting items in the athletic event is the 4 into 100 relay race. And the most exciting or important item is the baton exchange. Many a race has been lost because of the faulty handing over of the baton and the team is disqualified. This special Sunday reminds us of uh, handing over of the baton, handing over of the mission. God the Father sent his son Jesus Christ as a missionary into this world. As Saint John tells us, God so loved the world that he sent his only son. And Jesus, during his short stay of uh, three years of uh, public ministry, tried to instruct the apostles with regard to this mission. And once he, he having completed the leg of his relay race, he passed on the baton to the apostles. And the last recorded words of Jesus found in the Gospel according to Matthew is what we read in today's Gospel, 28th the chapter of Matthew. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations. Instead, Gospel according to Mark, rather, in the Acts of the Apostles, Luke tells us in chapter 1, verse 8, You will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea, Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. And these apostles, in turn, handed over this baton, this mission to their respective apostolic communities and they to their own successors. And today in 2017, we have inherited this mandate from the apostles and their successors. So I like to propose three models of this missionary mandate. First is the GO model, G-O, GO model. You know, this going forth is something that embraces the entire biblical account. Genesis chapter 12, God tells Abraham, Go forth from your country, from your kith and kin, and go to the land that I will show you. And Moses, for example, is told by God, Go to Pharaoh. Jeremiah, go to the um, household, household of Judah. And throughout the biblical history, we hear this message, go. And St. Thomas and St. Francis Xavier, the patrons of India, they heeded this call, go. Leaving their homeland, comforts of their existence, coming to the shores of our own land and spending their lives for us. And the hundreds of other missionaries who left the comforts of the homeland never to return. Albert Schweitzer, for example, multiple genius, outstanding philosopher, respected theologian, reputed historian, best soloist of his time, listens to the call of God at the age of 30 when he knew that he had to go to Africa, prepares himself as a medical doctor and opens a hospital on the edges of the jungles in Africa, ministering to the people there. And in 1950, he is awarded the Man of the Century. And later, he wins the Nobel Prize. So that is the GO model, active ministry. And if anyone hears this message from God, GO, be an active minister of the world. Second model is the Remain model. Saint Teresa of Lisieux, the patroness of the mission, never went out of the four walls of her convent. And yet, she is a patroness of the mission. 
She was a spiritual sister to two missionary priests through letters and through prayers. I remember of a veteran Salesian missionary father, Mauro Casaroti, who often called himself as a failed missionary because he had dreamt of coming to India and working in the Indian mission, riding on a horseback with a bucket of water, baptizing people. But it remained a dream. He was asked to form missionaries and he touched the lives of thousands of people, but not baptizing them, doing good on earth as St. Teresa of Child Jesus did. And the third model is what we call the witness model. I am reminded of uh, a meeting in an international seminar on evangelization where the people spoke about strategies to spread the gospel by preaching, by printing lab pamphlets and uh, uh, distributing copies of the Bible, etc. There was a young African lady who said, when we think a village is ready to receive Christ, we send a good Christian family to live in that village. In Karnataka, this is done by the members of uh, neo catechumenate Christian communities. They sent good Christian couples, families, and their influence changes the lives of people. So, brothers and sisters, on this Mission Sunday, we propose these, one of these three models. The Go model, the Remain model, and the Witness model. We have been the beneficiaries of the generosity of people in Europe and America. And now it is our turn to pay back through our prayers, through our missionary activity, and through our Christian witness. And God bless.